the video make sure you like comment and subscribe make sure you turn on your post notifications so you'll be notified whenever i post the video last time that i had posted a video i'm thinking that it was, it was in february that's when i had did the public interview at school and y'all was like oh my god y'all couldn't have been school oh they lit okay so at the time February, as I posted that video, it had got so heavy on me because I was trying to do this, go to school, and work at the same time. So I had to drop something, and when I dropped something, I ended up dropping you guys. But it was, I didn't mean to tend to just drop you guys and leave y'all, you know, leave y'all out of nowhere. Was gonna stop posting and stop dropping content because I remember I was posting back to back, 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 back. Um, but basically, after February, by me being a senior, I had to get prepped and ready for a lot of things like final exams, second week nine, second nine weeks down, first nine weeks down. Like it just was a lot. Because after we came back from spring break of, of school, literally, it was so heavy on me because I did not know that, oh, I was going to have to be actually focused and what I was doing by me trying to do, make videos, make content, it was draining. It was draining me so I had to drop something so I can, you know, focus on school so I'd be able to graduate when my time came. But I was so focused on my schoolwork, making sure I kept my grades up, and making sure I got all my scholarships or whatever I needed, you know, to go to college in the fall. And what I was going to major in, see, February was basically like when we came back, it was and like I think in March. March, we take, March or April, we would take our little uh, ACT, work keys, or whatever, whatever it was. Then we had a lot of prepping to do to get ready for ACT work keys, and it was a lot. Like it was just so much. If you if you was a high school senior, you know that it was a lot, and it was a lot of responsibility that had to be made in order for you to graduate. So basically, it just took a lot of effect on me because that I was trying to work. I was trying to make content and do videos and was going to school. And it just wasn't, it wasn't giving what I wanted to give. So I had to drop in in order for me to be on top and for to graduate. Because the, me graduating was the biggest thing that I, graduate high school was the biggest thing ever that shocked me because I'm really like I'm really into the real world like I'm really grown now I'm really going to have to start paying bills on my own and I'm really going to have to make decisions on my own now and it's like wow you really graduated and it really don't even feel like it guys like it do not feel like it at all like when I'm calm I know that I might just be in shock because like I really graduated in May like in May May 20th. I really graduated and no I literally finished my 12 years of high school. Like it ain't no going back. It ain't ooh I wish I could do this because life goes on. And it's very shocking because like what me out of school and like all the situation that I had been through when I was sick, when I was real down bad sick, and I just thought that I wasn't gonna be the person that I am today. And it's a blessing because like I overcome like a lot of situations and a lot making me feel like, girl, you did it, you did it, and I'm just very proud of myself. I'm proud of the person that I became. I'm proud. I'm proud of just being in a happy space with no negativity no bad vibes no nothing just basically just you your money your happiness whatever whatever and it feels good literally when you get yourself together and you know your worth 
and yourself love. March and April, it was just easy. Like, it went by so fast. Like, high school, it went by so fast, literally. And I was just basically, like, in shock because, like, what? It came so fast, literally. Like, when we took our, our last economic test, like, for that course, that final grade, I knew that, oh, this is gonna fly by. If it's gonna fly by, you finna help to do this, you finna help to do that, you finna help to make decisions, you finna help to stay focused. After I dropped my public interview video on YouTube, after that video, it got heavy. Like, it got heavy, y'all. When I say y'all, it got heavy, it got heavy. And I mean, all my class of 22 graduates, if you know, and if you graduated this year, and you know what you had to do and what you had to put last, like, it just wasn't a lot because, yes, it was a lot. And if all my people that know it was a lot, y'all know that it was a lot, you know. And it's just still in shock because, like, what's next like you in the real world it's time to make bigger decisions yeah i burnt myself but it's time to make a bigger decision it's time to stay out the way it's time to stay away from negativity because baby what don't happen nowadays like our days it's just like it's just so much happening in this world that make you just want to don't want to be involved with nobody in nobody's situation because like it's just so much crazy right? because you have to see and you just when you a person like i don't think i'm basically the only person just just see and just think like oh what world is we in like what is we going through god is you trying to tell us something what is it because basically i just have my mom where i just sit back and i just think because i'm like dang you know like what is this world coming to because like it's just so much violence y'all it's just so much and i just feel like it best to stay out the way when you Realize that ain't nobody your friend. Just remove your household. Be childish. You don't have to be with none of it. You don't have to be none with none of it. So that's the reason why I just remove myself from people and just start being there for people that be there for me and stick by me. Because nowadays, baby, you for be wish you watch it. They don't care what they do. They can you can be talking with them and they in that person face and they stay. Like it's just that and it's just it's just not giving. It's just not giving what I wanted to give. But anyway, my after April, it was May. It was literally May, y'all. Like when I tell y'all it went by so fast, like I just remember when we was just in the freaking ninth grade. Like when we was in the ninth grade, it was just so freaking like it was just I just remember when I was a baby, like look at me now, um um grown, we're basically grown, I'm basically gonna be here to make decisions on my own. I'm not gonna let nobody tell me what I can and I can't do because baby, yes you can, you can do anything that you put your mind to, whatever you put your mind to, you can go for it, don't let nobody tell you that you can't because baby, whatever you set your goals to do, make sure you go do it, don't let nobody stop you from doing what you want to do because they're gonna do what they want to do regardless, whether, whether if you say, no, don't do this, no, don't do that, they still gonna do what they want to do. So basically, you just got to keep yourself, put God first, and basically stay on your grind regardless. Just stay on your grind, stack your money. There are going to be people that down talk to you. There are going to be people that look at you sideways, cross-eyed, or whatever. But don't let that stop you. Let that motivate you to keep going. I wish 
that I could post the content that I had. Yeah, post the content that I did have, like, before I lost all my videos. Before I lost all my videos, I wish I could upload the videos, but they wouldn't upload for some reason. It wouldn't upload for some reason. But, guys. I'm back. That's all I can say that I'm back. I know the video might be all over the place because I was just basically just talking. So basically just be talking. So I hope that y'all understand like what I was saying. And you feel me? Make sure y'all just, you know, just keep doing what y'all want to do. Like whatever whatever you want to do, go for it. And basically put your mind to it. That's all I can say. Put your mind to it. Put God first. Put God first. And basically just do what you, do what you gotta do. Because the world now is basically just... I don't even know what to say. I don't even know what kind of word to use for it, Lord. I do not know what kind of word to use for it. But just make sure y'all put God first. Stay out of the way. Make sure you, you know who your fans are. Make sure you keep your head here high. Don't never look away. Make sure you pay attention to uh, everything that you do. Make sure you pay attention to it. all your surroundings. Make sure you pay attention to just everything that you feel like that you need to pay attention to. Because this word is yes, yes. And if you got kids, make sure you keep your kids by you every heart, like every minute, every second. Don't leave your kids with nobody if you don't help to. Don't leave your kids with nobody. Um, basically just, you know, do what y'all gotta do, but with that being said, I'm going to end the video off here, and I'm going to bring more content back, so with that being said, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, make sure you turn your post notifications, and your girl is out, peace.